that he commented and didn't like you chewing gum, sis. So all gum needs to be spit out into my hand. No thanks. That thing he says matter. If you don't like me chewing gum, you have got to get a new hobby because it's... What are we doing here? You... They didn't like you chewing gum and I chew gum. If the cum is chewy, you really need to go see a doctor, sweetie. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> no, yeah, we had a comment saying, why is he chewing gum? Well, some people can walk and chew gum at the same time, sweetie, so take that up with yourself. Hi, sis, how are you? Good, how are you? You know, we took last week off. Did you like your break from me? I did, I haven't seen you in days. I think it might have been over a week. And, you know, I started meditating, I found solace inside. I think we should break up. What? <laughs> so I can leave you at the firehouse like I usually do to my other drag daughters? Yes, it's like a curse. Like, all of our drag daughters have stopped doing drag at some point. I Welcome. don't know. You're the only drag daughter, you besides Veronica Pop that I know of. <laughs> and Kanda Couture. She's still part of my house. Well, you she's my drag she sister. Claim, yeah, she would have claimed me. She just called me <laughs> my sister. <laughs> but the other drag daughters, we don't speak of. Yes. What does watch this channel and texts me, harasses me still, but we won't speak about her. I have a daughter. Oh, you do have a daughter. Uh -huh. What's her name? Well, his name is actually Jackson. Oh, it's Ms. Jackson. In the gay world, yes. everyone's a she. Oh, you know. Ms. Jackson. Hi, your baby. Every time these camera lights go on, she goes, he goes crazy, ladies and gentlemen. They. It's they, they. They go crazy. Thank you. I love that. I'm being yelled at my drag daughter. Uh, all right, well, sis. Let's get started. Let's read the girls from the runway. So today's challenge was not only Snatch Game, but on the runway, the queens did had not to wear, wear bell pop hats. Fascinating fascinators. Yes. And today I'm giving homage to the first lady, Jackie O. I'm and just, you called me a bell I'm just not fascinated. You don't like this fascinator? <laughs> I am wearing Juan Chavez, and you're wearing Walmart. H &M. Oh, Walmart. <laughs> In the city. <laughs> Shut up. Alright sis, so, so um, I just had a quick question for you before we get started, since it was a Snatch Game ch um, challenge. I think this is one of the strongest episodes we've seen of Snatch Game. Mm -hmm. Also, out of you know, the past seasons, who is your favorite Snatch Game character ever? Definitely um, Anna Nicole Smith by Adore. I bet you beat me to it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like and a close body. second, Judge Judy. Judge Judy. With yeah. uh, Bianca Dover. Yeah, I also liked Maggie Smith by um, Ben Della oh, Nice. So good, yeah. But nice. season six also had a very strong snatch. Were you going to say Adore? Yeah. But you beat me to it. <laughs> like my body. Yeah. What did you think about the referee tonight? Oh, well, speaking of referee, <laughs> we had mother to all, RuPaul. So I think RuPaul always looks sickening, stunning, beautiful, but for some reason, I didn't like this fabric choice, Ru. I'm so sorry, please. I don't know what happened. Please, um. It's um, different for her. It's different? Yeah. All right. And the first one on the runway was Miss Olivia Lux, and she's giving us mad scientists. What did you think about the fascinator and the costume? We're going to talk about the fascinator first. It's what the challenge is about. Yeah. So. Uh, I really love the fascinator. Um, I'm not sure who made it, but it reminds me of some designs by Abraham Levy. Oh, uh, yes, yes, yes. He does those like corset things, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, I really like it. I think it's a smash. Um, I, love, I think it matches the costume really well. Yes, I wasn't a fan of her in the Snatch Game. She didn't do good. Mm -hmm. However, when this came down the runway, I love the character she played. Mad Scientist, there's a story. I love the gloves. It's very white. Mm. Don't wear white after Labor Day. No, I'm just kidding. But um, it's great. The fit's beautiful. I love the belts. Mm -hmm. I love the boots. Yeah. Um, the hair's cute. And the fascinator is fascinating. Ooh, very I'm getting bright here at what you're wearing. Okay. Oh. And next we have Rose. Yes. And she is literally a rose. Oh, Rose A. <laughs> I think she looked great. I love the flower on her head. I think it's a great idea. It's a great pun on her name. And I think she looked flawless. What do you think? I love the ruffles. I love the concept. I love the fascinator. The only thing about Miss Rose, I think she's talented. Um, I think she's think? doing great. I love the homage to her name on this. However, every time Rose rocks down the runway, she always looks mad or angry. <laughs> like, girl, smile. You're on RuPaul's Drag Race. Yeah. I just like... need her to give me a little more emotion in the face. Yeah. But right now, I feel like a little bit just because she's not giving emotion, the garments are kind of wearing her. Mm -hmm. But she looks great in this look. Next up, we have Utica. Utica. What'd you think? 
Um, I want to go to that picnic. I love, that. <laughs> I love her concept. She looks great. I love the fascinator. It's a picnic basket, like literally. Mm -hmm. She got the ants in the pants. Mm -hmm. She got the chaps. Mm -hmm. um, we got the picnic picnic fabric. Those butterflies are and everything. The butterflies, the um, detail to this, and the story, and it's a character. Yeah, we love her. I love it. There's nothing bad about it. Was she great in the snatch game? Absolutely not. It was not that good either. <laughs> but this look did save her. Yes. All right, moving on, we have the Simone. Yes. And this literally has a concept and a statement. T.S. Mm -hmm. Madison said this is a statement. It was all white. She turned around and said, say their names. She mm -hmm. had the bullets on the back. Beautiful. Great homage to obviously Black Lives Matter. Mm -hmm. This literally made me cry when I saw it coming down the runway. Mm -hmm. This is what I wanted with the Simone. Yeah from like last week, she literally amped up her runway. Yeah, I think it tells a great story. I love the structure yeah. of the whole um, fit. It, it tells a great story, and I think it's a much needed message to be on Drag Race. Yeah, say their name. Yeah. Love it. All right, moving on, we have Got Mick. What'd you think about her? Fascinating. She played it safety pin. Safety pin. Uh, <laughs> I love her fascinator. It's such a cool idea. I think what yeah. she's wearing is so original and different. It's very got mech. It's very punk rock mm -hmm. with the fascinator and you see the little blood on it. Yes. It's very fashion. Mm -hmm. And it's um like she said, she said she can finally be herself coming down the runway. Yeah. And this Phenomenal. is very got mick. This is why she's on drag race because of this. It's different. Mm -hmm. It's not like me. Hello. So we have Ms. Denali Fox and Bitch, let me tell you, when I need a cup of joe, she's gonna come through, okay? The coffee on her head. I love this. Mm -hmm. I love the fact that she's on roller skates. Yes, that was really Not cool. on ice skates, so she's not ruining the runway. And we haven't seen <laughs> a queen actually roller skate down the runway since sure? season seven. Oh, yes. When they had a roller skate challenge, mm -hmm. they were all falling. Um, mm -hmm. This is great, I would do this. I've been wanting to do a look like this on Drag Race, and bitch beat me to when? it. Because I'm still waiting for when, when they When are you going to do this look on Drag Race? I wanted to if I ever got cast, it is what I meant to say, but she beat me to it. I can roller skate too. Do you hear that? I can roller skate too. Oh, you I don't either. No, I know how to roller skate. Really? Yeah. Why don't we go roller skating sometime? I'm down, buy me some roller skates. We're going to do a video? Yeah. Um, so it. when I saw this, I was like, bitch, you stole my idea. No, but I thought she looked great. I love the coffee. Um, there's a concept. It's very camp. It's cute. Yeah. It's fun. It's campy and it's classy. I was very energized by her caffeine streak. <sighs> Moving on. Do we, we want to move on to this one? Okay. So we have Ellie with two teeth. Poor babe. <sighs> it's just not flattering to her. What are you wearing? <laughs> what are you wearing? In your face. It feel like she doesn't even want to be there anymore. She kind of did look a little over it. Mm -hmm. Maybe because she kind of maybe knew she did bad in the snatch yeah. game. But the thing about this is, it's not the fascinator. The fascinator is great. I love the color palette, mm -hmm. but the hair, the way it's sitting. Yeah, it's very the, like an afterthought. Yeah, and then the fabric girl mm -hmm. is, and if you're gonna do a nude illusion, I wanna see nude illusion. If you're gonna do a nude, nude if you're gonna do a nude illusion, mm -hmm. make sure it's form fitting and we can see yeah. the nude. Well, I don't think that, the, that was like a mistake. I think it was a design thing and it just didn't work. It's not yeah. a cup of tea, ladies and gentlemen. The fascinator is gray. I've seen her wear better things mm -hmm. on this season, but unfortunately, this was not her runway. Yeah, love you, Elliot. Yeah. Moving on, we have Tina Burner. Tina Burner, what are you wearing? She is a literal horse. <laughs> are we gonna tip her in oats? I said that one so queen. I, and I she needs it. to change her horseshoes because this is just not working out for me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So, Miss Tina, I like the campiness to it. Yeah. I like the structure of that bodice and that skirt, but... <laughs> the fast... What is that? But the fascinator <laughs> does not look like a fast... It literally looks like a penis. It's a nay, It looks girl. like a penis on her head. It's a, a nay. nay. <laughs> yeah, no. But, but girl, I do like there was an idea there. Yeah. It wasn't bad, but it kind it was of definitely missed, executed. It, but missed the mark. The, the the jacket's cute. The skirt is fabulous, but the past it looks like a penis on her. Want to sit on it? <laughs> a horse penis? Very that. The camera before yelling at us. It's a horse cock. A horse. Oh, we can't say that on YouTube, can we? Well, you're not monetized. It's a next, so. horse. Okay, and last but not least, we have Candy Muse. Candy Muse, you want to go first? Yeah, I think that Candy looks great. Um, I do like the costume. It's not like 
a form-fitting silhouette, but it looks great on her. I think it was a great choice. Um, and then there's the Fascinator. <laughs> um, I, I, great idea, I just think it was like not amazing. <gasps> it's not the worst of the night. I disagree you know? with you. Okay, so I thought this look was amazing. Yeah. This is fashion forward. Like we said, the silhouette works good for um, candy. It's a baby doll dress mm -hmm. with lots of ruffles. And I like that it says. She looks phenomenal. I like that it says Muse. I would do something like that with my name. Yeah, I think it should just been would have. I think it should have been more like thought out as like thicker so we can see it better and like I don't know. I just think it could have been like it could have taken it to the next level like some of the other girls, but it just didn't like set the bar. It fell like in the middle. It fell short. Yeah. Okay, I can see that. I middle thought of the it pack. Miss mm -hmm. Candy. What about my fascinator. I think you look like the only bellhop. Here we go. I'm not a bellhop. I'm a little Latin boy in drag. <laughs> little Latin boy in drag. Why are you crying? I'm not, even, you I'm not even little. I'm bitch. I'm old. How about you stand up? No. <laughs> we're still doing, <laughs> we're stu still doing quarantine drag digital here. Digital drag. I love digital drag. You don't have to pad. Yeah, or lip sync, apparently. I'm box. wearing a jock strap. That's what I'm wearing. <laughs> All right, like the jet of it. <laughs> Me too. Uh, yeah, that's what she's wearing too. Mm, uh, only a jock strap. Only a drag strap. So It'll you can use your imaginations. And it can run wild. Are you gonna be carrying a uh, are you gonna be carrying a drag stop? Are you gonna be carrying a jock stop for the drag stop? Probably not. Okay. She said not my cup of tea. Yeah. Not my brand. I just buy them. Mm -hmm. Oh, are you gonna buy me Mike? Not you. Oh. My other boyfriends. Oh, okay. Couple. I am your mother. We have a rotation. That is so weird. I'm your mother. Okay. All right. So thank you so much for joining me this evening. Of course, it was I love great doing to this. Having you back. Don't forget to give the drag stop a follow at the drag stop. Are you taking any commissions right now? What's next for you? We are all booked up for March, but if okay. you look at my stories, I always announce when I am taking new orders. And if you tune into next week's episode, we have a little surprise. Oh. Oh. I love surprises. Yeah, so if you love giveaways, I would definitely watch this video, watch next week's video, and tune in. Yes, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and give me a follow at It's April Showers Official, ladies and gentlemen. Also, don't forget that I have a brunch here in Southern California, right in Orange County, the heart of Santa Ana, called mm -hmm. It's Raining Brunch. It's the best where, brunch in Orange County. Yes, where we follow CDC guidelines, where you have to wear a mask, and we also practice social distancing because we're still in the middle mm -hmm. of the pandemic. Don't forget, ladies and gentlemen, still wear your mask and wash your hands. You can see but all the out. divas. Yes. Um, link below. I will have the tickets. Get your tickets because people are accounted for, and the sooner um, we sell out, the sooner you can see the And I think you're having like some of the drag race girls yes, even yes, on Gina, yes, yes. Delta Work. We have um, Delta Work joining us uh, next Sunday and then mm. on Gina will be joining us at uh, the end of the month and then we just had Morgan yes. and Michaels who um, joined us and we're going to have more fabulous drag race stars joining us. So make your reservations today don't, and get your tickets. Don't you have that one girl girl between April sh sh shitters or? What? I don't. <laughs> I'm not a rude girl. At least not yet. Bye, Bye, Bill. Bye, Bill. <laughs> I can't Since follow I'm ready for the bags. Go get your bags. We'll carry them for you. I gotta go. <laughs> Goodbye.